Greetings and welcome to Preserve. I'm Catherine of Sky and I'm really delighted to play this game for you. A huge thank you to the developer who sent me a key for this demo. Um, anyway, you can play this for free as well on Steam, so check it out. Um, this game is one of these like minimalist hex tile placement games but it has many different things to the ones that we've been building before mostly the difference as you will see is this deals with animals and nature and not about human settlements but there are also a lot of other things that are like in a lot of other games it's like make 450 tiles of forest this one is like hey, can you get these tiles to abut each other and therefore an animal can live there? Hmm. So anyway, we're going to play this and it's so far, it's fun. So we're going to play the European biome. That's the only one we're available that is available to us. We're going to play classic mode here. So let, let's play small and see how far we can get. Look at this running fox. Also, huge, huge uh, props on the music. It sounds amazing. However, can we please see not a general camera invert because I want to invert the up down this drives me crazy because I want to invert that however if I do that the scroll is inverted and scroll is I think more important I don't know it's hard to choose but yeah I would love the option to invert one or the other like you know individually anyway so what we're gonna do is we start off with this barren wasteland this is what it's called barren wasteland and we're going to need to um, water these areas um, and that gives us points to unlock more cards. As you see, we get these cards. These are good cards. This big rainstorm, you can see, it's at, this is so clever. Look at this design. It literally lets you water in a pattern like this, right? So we don't need to water these green tiles, but it does water a huge area. So when we get new pieces of land, like for example, around here, for example, let's go ahead and just water this here. It's a lot more efficient than, uh, than the previous thingy thingy so let's go and water a little bit of this and we are presented with yet more cards actually we can we can also get another land mass over here and use more thunderstorms to get this place going let's just do that and then we have individual things where we can uh, rain on individual tiles as i showed earlier um, and then we have our biomes. This is crazy cool. So we have uh, forest, we have flowers, and we have mountains and savanna or wheaty stuff. And then we have animals. So here's an animal that thrives in a flower area next to a savanna. So let's see. One thing that I would suggest, these numbers at the bottom here are really hard to see. They're like almost the same color as a border, but white on light green is not very visible so i hope that that can be improved for visibility because i can barely see the numbers maybe it's the screen i'm working on right now but the contrast is not enough um so let's start we, we want to cater to our little bee here we only have two bees that's a tiny problem but one we'll hope to fix soon um all right so let's do that let's let's choose a place where we can have two abutting biomes oh we only have one. Oh boy okay Let's get these guys, all right. So we can add a bee, or we can't add a bee. I think there's not enough uh, savanna. Anyway, let's get a forest going. Let's try to start this forest over here. Um, and then hopefully we'll get enough points to get something else. There we go, we got a rock over here. Let's get these rocks happening. Oh, okay, we can make more of those. All right, let's see. We have more flowers, so let's add these flowers over there. Ah, there we go. We got a proper biome with three tiles, as you see. That just kind of popped up there. We need to water these in order for that to be a proper savanna. Okay, there we go. So what we can do here is we can add our bees into this area so that they can thrive. And once you add three of an animal, that means you can, um, you will get uh, an extra 10 points so that's very very advantageous all right let's go here and we're going to water more of this fun stuff let's do this like here yeah there that's a good spot that's a very good spot oh look what we have here we got a boar who likes forest and marshlands now we haven't experienced any marshlands yet 
Um, but goats, they like, uh, is it flowers plus, uh, it's either savanna plus rocks or flowers and rocks. I don't remember. Anyway, we can add some more forest here and get that going. Uh, maybe we can find some marsh cards later. Uh, we have one more rock, so let's get that one over there. Um, let's add some more savanna here. Oh, whoops, we have to water this. Um, we can add one there, kind of expand it in that direction. Okay, and now we need some more forest, I think. All right, and then we can water some more tiles. But it doesn't look like we're actually gonna get to the next area, are we? Oh yeah, we should, we should actually get to the next area. Let's get kind of this central area filled out here. There we go. Okay. Oh, we got to the next area. Okay, that's good. I always like to keep some in reserve. Okay, so it is flower and mountain. Ooh. So here we go. Hey, goat. Let's go. Let's add some flowers down here so that these goats can thrive in this area. Can we add more? Hello? No? Why not? Maybe we can't add it until we add a sixth rock. I'm thinking that's the case, probably. Uh, let's add that one there. Yeah, there we go. I bet that's what it is. There we go. Okay, Nanny Goat, let's go. So we haven't gotten the swamp card yet. Can we add more bees? We can. We can add one more. Uh, we need 12 um, tiles. Can we do this? No, not yet. We have 10. That's not ideal. Can we add a boar in the forest? We can. All right. So it looks like they want either or. I thought they had to have both. That was my misreading of this. But anyway, when we are able to add three animals, then we can um, we can get more points. We can get like 10 points for this. There's 12. Okay, let's add another boar. Three of a kind. Woo, we got stuff. And we, got, we unlocked two new land masses. This is fantastic. All right, let's add you there. And then we're going to add this one somewhere here. Sure, why not? Ooh, what is this? This is pond, maybe. That looks like a pond. Sure, let's go with pond. Um, I don't know what would go up against that for now. Let's see. So, Nanny Goat, um, we need 12 rocky bits. I don't... Oh, we have a few more. Oh, we have actually much more. The cool thing is the rocks can be put on stuff that you don't have to water, I think. That was something. I don't know. The cats, I think, went crazy there. All right. Did we unlock it? Two more. We want two more here. Hello? Can I... Hello? Why won't this... Maybe it's not high enough. I think the elevation isn't high enough for these guys. Yeah, that's not... That's unfortunate. Uh, that was in the tutorial about the elevation bits. Okay. So, let's see. We have this forest. And I'm thinking we probably need like a different forest in order to add new animals to another forest. So let's see. Uh, Nanny goats, we can't actually add that yet. So that's unfortunate. What is this? Hello, leaf? Oh, reach 400 to harmony. Okay, that's fine. Um, all right, bees. We need 12 of these grasslands. So let's go ahead and add more. There we go. And add some bees. Hooray, three of a kind. We get 30 points for this. Did I understate the points before? I thought it was like 10 points, but no, it's it's 30. Uh, no, I think adding an animal is 10 points and three of a kind is an extra 30 points. There we go. Um, right, so now I wanna figure out what else we can add where, where we wanna add stuff. We can't add any more animals to the forest here. So maybe we make a new forest, uh, maybe out here. That could be okay, why not? Here we go. Okay, that's all the forest we have at the moment. So we can actually add two boars here. And, ooh, there's our 12. We can actually add another boar if we have one to this forest. We can add a new landmass. Now we can rotate this with X and Z. So let's try that. Uh, sure. This is good, because I want to continue these rocks. Uh, remember, we wanted those um, to put our nanny goat up there. 
So there's 12. We can put our goat. Hey, three of a kind. Yay. Oh, this is so nice. So the flower area, we kind of have to like expand to the side here a bit. Um, because otherwise, yeah, it's not big enough. But now we can add our third bee. Yay, three of a kind. Now we have new animals. Look at this. We have a beaver. <gasps> or is that a beaver? I think it's a beaver. Swamp and plains. Okay. Yeah. Let's see if we can add our beaver to here. No. Okay. Apparently not. Hello? Oh, we've won. Okay. Back. Well, okay, you know, let's do a medium map. Let's try that medium map. Uh, okay, here we go. Yay. Okay, medium map. Let's go. A stitch in time saves nine. I never understood that until, I don't know, I think it was relatively recently where it's like, uh, well, I'm confused about this. How am I supposed to get that many points without having uh i don't know oh okay oh it water oh okay so i wasted some points there haha <laughs> whoops okay uh anyway it's it's a it's a, it's the thing like if you uh sew something if i mean if you fix a patch it won't get bigger that's what it means so i didn't understand that before we have a river wow how does that work Let's try to put it on this mountaintop and see. No, that doesn't work. Can we rotate this? Mm, X and Z maybe? No, that's bad. Uh, no. Uh, help? Okay, it looks like I have to put it on a mountain, but then it doesn't do anything. It just like flows downward. Maybe you have to start the river and then, how do I rotate this? I would love to rotate the placement of this thing because I want it to flow down that way. Oops, this thing. Uh, there's no like tool tip here telling me if I can do that or not, but you definitely have to place it on a, on a mountain. That doesn't work well, I don't know. Can I, can I? If I rotate the game, does it... Oh, wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, that's cool. You can apparently... No. Okay, it looks like it has to go down gently. I don't know. Uh, let's try this. No. Okay, it doesn't like it doesn't even let me place it there. It's like, yo, no, we're not gonna let you do this. Can I do this? Oh, that's how to do this. Okay, we understand now. Mm. Now we understand. Okay, you have to click on each tile that you're happy with. And look how much it irrigated. Wow, that's cool. Oh, that's so nice. Okay, cool. So what do we got now? Create a river 18 tiles long. Oh, wow. I don't know why it didn't let me go down here, but it didn't. So anyway, let's let's make things. Let's figure out things. And then we have, let's do some marshlands. Can we do that? Let's do it around this pond. Oh, okay. We get one tile. Okay. Okay, we can do new land. Let's go ahead and rotate this tile to be like this. I think that would be better. I would love to make a river, uh, hmm. maybe starting up here, no, here, going down this way. That might be, how many is that? Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven, twelve. 11, 12. That's not 18. Okay, well, we'll have to figure it out later. All right, so let's get these forest bits. There we go, forest. And then we can get mountainy bits. One, two, three, four. Oh no, oh no, I went over my river thingy, thingy, crap. Uh, grumble, whoops. Okay, we can add another thing here. 
to be here. If we add this there, wait, what if, what if we rotate this thing to be like that? Um, rotate it again. Yes, that's better. So we could do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, fifteen. Okay, okay, we're working it. We're working this river angle, which is, seems quite weird by now. All right, these guys, bees, we want you in here. Okay, that's fine. Um, I really, I want to make this river. I want to make a river. Okay. Let's make more of this. Okay, we can get our mountain goats to live here, though. And then the boar can live in the forest. Yay. Okay. And then honeybees. We already have honeybees. Um, and then forests. Let's add those. We can do a little bit more of watering. I love the music. It's so nice. It's really nice. Okay, there's, we can have another honeybee in here. Okay, and now, boar? No, we need more forest. So let's just add those there. Did we unlock? Yes, I think we did. Yep. Okay, again, the contrast on this was like really hard to see. Maybe it's better if I just, yeah, it's like I think it's too see-through. I wish that wasn't a see-through, I think. I think that would help with that immensely. Okay. Uh, rocks. Rocks. Let's go. This one is already open. All right. Let's add... What can we add here? Oh, these have uh, goats. I forgot. Boris go in the forest. Okay. We need to add some more land on this side because we're, <laughs> we're kind of lacking in land. Hmm. This one doesn't match with any of these low-level tiles, which we kind of need for other things. The This thing is already overrun, so I'm just going to add this this way. All right, let's see. We can probably do... Uh, we're missing out on two tiles of that, but that's ah, okay. It's fine. We have a lot of singleton tiles, which are okay here. Yeah, you can't water the rocks either. So, let's see. Let's make sure that we have... Our for uh, okay, our forest, which is not anymore. Okay, fine. We finally got a marsh. Ooh, that's fun. Yay. Uh, but let's make a meadow. We can't place any animals right now. I may have to be forced to destroy my thingy over there, unfortunately. We can actually start making a rock biome over here, though. Uh, anybody live in the in the rocks? No, of course not. Can we do? We can do this. Do these have to be? It has to be on the lowest ground. Wow. Okay, that's hmm, not ideal, and it also has to be near water. This stuff. Interesting. Can I? No, I can't get a thing. I can't get my 18 tile river. Ugh. Okay, fine. All right, thing. If you want to be that way and pesky and all the things, fine. I'm going to try to use these to best effect. I was going to use the river as free thing, but it's not giving me another river, which is quite inconvenient at the moment. So we'll have to just figure out a different way. Um, let's see. We can do a pond. Oh, I could have done a pond here, and that would have watered it. Shoot. All right, well, let's put a pond. Maybe we'll put the pond here so that we can put this stuff around it, this swampy biome. I think that's good. Can we put the... Uh, oh, we can put it up here because the pond is there as well. That's nice. Let's see. Boars can live in ponds. Excellent. Now we got 30 points. Perfect. Uh, all right, so now, now, we can put some more bees. No, we cannot put more bees. We have to expand this further for that to happen. What do we got here? We got a little bit of 
Uh, no. Can I undo? No, I, I can't undo this. Oh, no. All right. Let's put this... Rotate this. Do this that way. And expand stuff as if we were having another... Ooh, that looks very interesting. Let's see. Can I do a that? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, that would be 18, probably. If I had a river. I got no rivers. Okay, so bees, we need another few tiles for this. Um, but luckily, we can just water these guys and make them into these savanna tiles. That's only nine, though. Uh, but we could go on this side. There we go, that's 12. Nice. And we can put another bee in here. Alright, plus 30 points. Yay. Alright, now, what are we doing next? We need to have more mountain goats here. That's nice. And... Oh, that's only 10. Eh, 11? <laughs> I can't get the 12th one. Shoot. Uh, Alright. All right. Mm. Okay, what else can we do? Mm. We need many more points. I still want my river to be here. But it ain't working. We could put boar. Do we need... Okay. We could make a forest up here. Uh, up here. On this part that it's definitely not going to end up in. And put a boar... We can get two in here. So we need ten more points. Can we put another goat up here? No. Do we have... Oh, we can put the goat in the meadow, though. That'll give us our, our points. All right, so what do we want to do? We've got a beaver. Can't live there. Can't live anywhere, as far as I can tell. Bees, we need to expand the, the flower biome. We have 18 tiles. Holy fuzzy cats. However, we also would like to get a couple more forest biomes, but we don't have a lot of tiles um, for the for this this thing. We need six more tiles. We only have five forests, but we do have many flower biomes. Dang it. How about this stuff? We have 11 of this. This one is already done, so I'm feeling like we should add another whole tile here and make a lot of it. Um... This stuff. Yeah, I think that's that's the best the best solution here with this. Okay, so let's put in We have only eleven tiles. Oh, we only have eleven tiles, darn it. But that means we can get in a couple of animals. Let's have some beavers in here. Oh, we only have one beaver? Dude! Oh, I feel shortchanged by my beavers. Uh, all right. Anyway, it's okay. We'll we'll be fine. It will be fine. Um, these will just add the um, more of the flower bio, so we can put in goats that we don't have. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Whoops. Okay. So we have this. Um, what else can we do here? Oh no. I don't want to get this part wet. I want to get a river, and we haven't gotten our damn river yet. Ugh. So frustrating, this. Um, so it's like, I know what I want to do, but the game isn't giving me a river. It's so naughty. Maybe I should never have played the river. No, I think I had to play the river card, because we didn't have enough points to get anything else done. Um, all right, so what do we got here? We got a goat in the flowers. We, we can't do... Oh. Oh, well, we could put this in here, but then we wouldn't have three of a kind. We can't evict the goat either. Apparently, it's just too far gone for that. Um, we have... Yeah, we don't have enough of forest. We can put more down. We can do that. Let's see. We can put down what we have. That'll give us some points, at least. Not a lot. Uh... Shoot. Yeah, we need one more forest tile. Oh, no. We can recycle. What does recycle mean? Recycle your cards, maybe? Can I recycle... Mm, the 
wolf. Oh, you can recycle a tile. Ooh. May maybe that's what it means. Maybe you can recycle a tile. Like have this river go shorter. Looks like I can click this if I wanted to. Let's see what that does. Okay. <gasps> okay. Oh no. Okay, so that then we can place it back and get our B back. All right, cool. Uh, so we, now we figured out what that does. So if you've make a, made a mistake by putting something down, can you recycle an animal though? I don't think so. Like this doesn't even show where the beavers are. No, I wish it would ask me, dude. So we, do, we have these beavers in there. Wait, ooh, if I make it unsustainable, then the animal will come back, right? There are no animals in there, right? Yeah, right. Okay, cool. So now we can give this to the bees. That's more points, effectively. But we're still at a very grave disadvantage here. Um, I guess what I could do... No, 26. I need a lot of points. Where am I going to get all these points? Shoot. Put one there. I don't know. I want a river. I want a, a river. Uh, I think I'm too stuck on this river idea. Because um, they gave me a challenge and I'm trying to do it, but they won't give me the darn cards. That's annoying. Um, what can I do with stuff? It looks like I could do a small biome for flowers. Okay, that gives me a little bit of extra points. Um, rock biome we have. We could just start building biomes from the left. We have five pieces to add this a biome for 1B. Let's see, one, two, three. 1B can go there. But we're only at 561. This is not ideal. I could add a pond there. That makes that, you know, wet. Which is nice, I guess. Uh, but I don't see any other combinations here that will give us 20 more points. Um, boars, we need more forests. We don't have any more forest tiles. That's quite unfortunate. And the wolves. Oh, we can add wolves maybe. Or not. Here, we can add one here. Oh, jeez, I'm like nine points off. Well, we could add a three-point biome. What do we got the most of? Flowers. Okay, let's do some flowers. One, two, three. And that actually doesn't impede our river. Oh, my God, we got the river card. Oh, we got it. Oh, okay, okay. Now we count. We're going to count. We need how many tiles? 18 tiles. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Ooh, all right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You bet I'm going to take advantage of every single tile of this river. Of course, it's like using up all this land that I can probably ill afford because I haven't seen any river animals yet. But boom. Boom got the thing 46 points fantastic all right cool How, does this one give us any all right i'm i'm very pleased about that <laughs> if you couldn't tell <laughs> all right i want to let oh i should have mm. Ooh, we have a water wheel that's interesting um all right so we have some uh forest cards i think this would be a good opportunity for forest cards just putting though we do have we only have one needed over there uh, we need uh, rock animals. We could add this here. Let's rotate this this way. Okay, let's do that. We do have another tile or two that we can add for our forest, giving us the ability to add our three of a kind into the forest. Yay. And then this forest needs... Okay, we need 
we have 10, we need two. So let's add two more forest tiles there. One and two. Okay, did we get more points for that? I don't even know. Okay, we got boars living there. Let's go. Yes, three of a kind there. Boom. All right, so who else needs stuff? So we have a nanny goat living in, the, in here. We can add two more. Yay. Now, we got rid of those beavers. <laughs> what about wolves? Do we have any wolves? No. We just have... Wait, these are wolves. Okay. We can add more tiles to the rocky areas. Uh, hello? Hello? Okay, they have to be tall tiles. Oh, no! I... Oh, wait. These work. 11, 12. Okay. So now... Oh, my God! We got ostriches. No, those aren't ostriches. They're not ostriches. <laughs> There's something else. What is this? It's a duck. Oh, I'm glad we got a duck because it lives in this, like, yay. It lives in the, the, um, the flower area. We need more of those, I think. We need more flower area animals. Okay, do we have another nanny goat? Yes, we do. Boom, 30, three, 30 points, three of a kind. Okay, who else we got living here? We got deer. We don't need deer. We need more bees. We definitely need more bees. So this, this bee actually is left alone. Uh, so that's not great. So what do we got? We need a lot of savanna. This one is already populated. This one needs bees. What is this thing? I mean, it's obviously it's a water wheel, but I wonder what, what it does for us. Hello? Here. Let's put it here. Oh my god! That was a lot of points. Yo! Ho! <laughs> that was great. <laughs> that was fantastic. Oh my god! And they gave me another river! Ah! I've gone wild with rivers. Whoops. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, what do we do here? Should we um, expand our our rocky area? Let's see how many. We already have many pieces of that rock area. I feel. Let's add it here, maybe, so we can expand this like uh, like uh, what do you call it? Flower area. I like that flower area. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I've gone wild with rivers. <laughs> Totally wild. Now, what else do we have? Let's look at combinations of like things. Okay, so we have forest animals, nine, none of which we have three of. So we can't make a three of a kind of any animals right now at all. We still need uh, 23 points to get to the next level of unlocking this. So what do we do about this? Um, we can't get any animal unlocks we can get some terrain unlocks maybe we put another forest out here that could be okay yeah we could do that we could do that let's do that okay and let's get some here you go there so let's get forest happening here there's three Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay, we got that. We got more animals. Whoa, okay, we got an eagle. Can we get that eagle to live somewhere? Wait, is nobody living here? No? Hello? No, it's already complete. That's why it doesn't show. Okay, it doesn't show because it's complete. All right, do we have any eagle bits? One thing I kind of wish is like you could maybe, I don't know. The cards are getting hard to see. That's my problem. Uh, some way to fix that part. I was going to say, like, have one, like, open, close folder for biomes and one for animals. But I think it's easier to see them as they are. So I, I'm not going to say that. I think we're just going to leave that. Okay, let's get some rocky bits here. Oh, these all fit. So let's just do this. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Those are the easiest, obviously. 1, 2, 3. Yes! Okay, we now have eagles. The eagles have landed. Mm. And we have no more animals. We need, we need more animals. Let's see, does anybody... Oh, lots of people live in swamps. Okay, people. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're nice people. It's fine. Um, this would be a good spot for like a pond. I think we can do a pond here, or several, even. So if we do a swamp up here... Hello? No? No? Why? Oh no! My, my, my swamp has, has... 
been unexpectedly annoying. Okay, uh, we might need to recycle all of this. I can't recycle the pond. Shoot. All right, well, we got green around it. That's something saying something. Okay, what else can we do here? We have animals, many animals, but hmm. we have 22 flowers. So there's a lot of, there's three different flower animals. I feel like that's a good one to put down. One, two, oh, oh, that's actually expanding that flower area. That's quite nice. Uh-huh, and we'll add... We'll just take these two to be flower areas. God, I love this game so much. It's so pretty. I really like this. Look at this. Look at how detailed everything is. It's so pretty. I like this. And look at the eagles. Oh, look at this. Just marveling here at all the nature. It's so, I like these goats. Oh my God, they are not aware of clipping at all. They just walk through mountains. But you know, that's really on brand for a goat. Goats do this. They walk through mountains. It's a mystery, but yeah, it's cool. All right, I will leave the animals until we can actually place them in a good amount of animalage. That's not a word, by the way. If anyone's learning English from my work, don't don't use animalage. That's not a word. Hey, cat. Cat, cat, can you please not stand on my phone? That's not great. Do you know that cats can, that like, you know, it's like a finger touch. Cats can walk on your phones and they mess stuff up. Okay, we have five of this. We have eight of this. We have swamps which don't work very well. And 23 grasslands. We have a couple of grassland animals, so let's go and choose these. Let's try to get six. There we got our six. Wow, we need many. Oh, you know what? It's not giving us any more landforms. No, we can't win with this. All right, let's go to the next one then. Fine. Three unique biomes with the full game. Three harmony modes, including rivers and natural wonders. Ten puzzles in each biome. Unlimited creative mode. I like this game a lot. I don't know if you could tell. I like it. Okay, next game. We're going to do... Oh, no, that's it. Oh, that's all there is. Oh, no. Do we have puzzle mode? Let's try puzzle mode. I don't know what this is about. Let's try it. Let's have a go. Optimal placement. Okay. Okay. Really? Uh. Okay. Let's see. We got three forest animals and 12 foresty bits. So this is the biggest area. But this may contain more cells. We get three of these. Ah, yeah. So this, these three have to go there. So that the forest can go into all this area. 12. Okay. Animal. Animal. And animal. Yay! We won. Hooray. You saved the natural diversity. Next level. Alright, so this that was easy. Well, you know, a little bit of thinking. Okay, so we have one of these. Let's choose the part with the biggest area, which is these three pieces. Ah, yep, yeah, nice. I hope this is enough. I didn't quite calculate on the side bits. There we go. Boom. Got it. Okay, next level. Don't count your chickens before they hatch. But you can count your eggs. And if you want to sell them at the market, go for it. Okay, so pond, I think, will go here. And then you will have to go... Either way, it's missing one. So that should be enough, I hope. Yep, there we go. Yay! That's cool having a pond at the top of that mountain there. It looks like a, like a pool or something that somebody constructed. Because it has the rock around it. Okay, what do we got now? We have a pond. Four ponds, to be precise. Let's try this. Okay, so that does do higher elevations as well. Oh, that's easy peasy. Now then, we've got four ducks and four birds. Uh, I am very confused by this. Okay, so these can live in mountains. These can live in swamps. Okay, the swamps have to be down here, I believe. So let's place those first. 
We can do three more to have six. And that gives us three birds. One, two, three. One, two birds. Two birds only. All right. And then we can do our flowers around here. And then have more live here. Okay. Yeah, we're getting this. We're doing the thing. So here we can get one, two, three, four, five. So I think I messed up. Six. Yeah. Because then I can't have a full thing there. I'm not sure how else to do that one, though. Because it has to be all tall. I don't know. Yeah, this is not going to work out, I don't think. Yep, it's only one bird. Okay, retry. Yes, restart. Restart it, dang it. So that part is very easy. Let's try one... I need to figure out where the rocks go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ah, there we go. That's where it goes. All right. That's fine. And of course, this has to go here. All right. Uh, birds, boom, boom. Eagles, boom, boom. And then we can have the grass and the savanna anywhere. I think that works. Like, yeah, there we go. A little bit tricky, this one, but it works. Works, works. I like the idea of these geese wandering through the, this, like, flower field. That's cool. When in Rome, do as the Romans do. That is true, man. And it works for everywhere else. When in Stockholm, do it as the Swedes do. Mm, works well. Uh, especially, like, in terms of, like, you want to save money or other things like that. Very good advice. All right. So what do we do here? I think we do this. All right. So we have many animals. Some of them only need uh, a few tiles of biome. Um, yes, we need to do three different forests, I think. And put one animal in each forest. I think that's the way this works. I'm not really sure how to separate them very well. One, two, three. But we'll do our best. And then let's do some rocky ones. One, two, three. Actually, you can do six. Well, no. Since we want one in each. Oh my god, we had too many of those. Whoopsies. Uh, I think I messed it up. I think this area needs to be uh, thingy. Needs to be rocky. Um, actually, maybe we don't use that one. We don't use that card. Because I think... So, we have three wolves. And we have 12 rocks biomes. So I think what we do is... No, we need to do a... Mm, a six, one, two, three, four, five, six, and a three, and maybe another three, right? Because we have wolves, one, two, and wolf, and then we have the mountain goat, which also needs the rocks. Can we do these here? We can. One, two, one, two, doesn't work there, doesn't work there. We can do it there, though. Okay, you rocky goat, you go there. Nice. Okay, very nice. Um, let's do this. One, two, three. Goat. One, two, three. Deer. Uh... I'm not really sure what happened here. Um, we ended up with one giant forest, which I think is not good. Yeah, somehow that didn't work. And I don't know what really happened with this. Not actually sure. Can I put a rock there? Okay. So we needed to have rock. Let's do the rocks first again. Six. And have two wolves here. Okay, that's fine. Then we can have one forest here. Can I put rocks there? Yes. Okay, that's fine. 
Uh, or I can do rocks here, but that cuts off this one. I think I can put this here. And I need rocks to be... Hmm. I need rocks to be elsewhere. This is very interesting to have to separate the foresty bits. So they're not inconvenient spots, I have to say. Very not inconvenient spots. Let's try this. We can do Let's see a breakpoint here. There are no other animals that are just one of a kind though. I don't know how I'm supposed to do this. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Mm. Oh, but that's also attached there. I can do one up here. But that tile is needed for rocks, too. I don't know how I'm supposed to separate these areas of rocks and forest. Because I need several rocky areas. Or several forest areas. I need three distinct forest areas. And they're not supposed to blend together. I'm afraid I don't really know how to do that right now. This is very weird. Do this. One, two, three. But I don't... That's not going to work. So put this one here. And put the mountain goat there. So we need... Well, we only need two more areas, right? Yeah, one of each. Oh, okay. We're fine. We're fine then, I think. You can live there. What the heck was that sound? Uh, but we do have six more tiles. Oh, no. Uh, that's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. I guess I can just do that anyway. So we have two more of these. Place these two again. Yeah, that's going to mess that up. No, nope, I don't know how to fix this. I don't know what, what the um, synchroni synchronicity of this is. As in, like, are you supposed to put animals next to other animals? Or, I don't know. I can't get anywhere near the score. So, oh well. It's okay. Uh, no, let's just go back to the main menu. Uh, yeah. Anyway, so I hope you've enjoyed this journey through Preserve. Um, again, huge props to the developer. This is a really nice game. Uh, really good interface. Again, just, just please add the individual camera reversal thingy thingies. Um, but yeah, UI is great. The music is very chill and relaxing. The graphics are gorgeous. Really a pleasure to play. And I hope that I am able to play it in the full version to show you that as well in the future when it comes out. But right now it's a demo, so you can play this game. Uh, and check it out on Steam. Um, so anyway... Thank you so very much for joining me. If you want to help support my work, do check out the Patreon links in the description below. Remember to pat the ducks. This is a perfect game for patting ducks. Feed the ducks, as in feed the algorithm. Click the like button. Feed them ducks. And um, I'm, I'm delighted to actually play a game with ducks. So thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other. And I'll see you next time.